everyone. How are you all doing? Uh, happy weekend. Welcome to another Let's Play. Uh, I'm Miles Dyer and I am on a quest to do a Let's Play of every PSVR 2 title there is because PSVR 2 is just awesome. Uh, I want to say hi to everyone in the chat. We've got Brian from Without Parole. Good to see you here, my brother. Um, I also want to say a huge thank you to Silver Nexus for the uh, $5 super chat. Thank you. And uh, I know, good chat, right, Brian? Um, we're kicking off this weekend with Masternoid, which looks like an awesome retro game that I have actually not even touched yet. And I want to say a huge thank you to Pixel Magnet for giving me the game key. Um, this came as a bit of a surprise this week, and so I quickly slotted it in uh, at the start of this weekend's run of Let's Plays. Um, so be sure to subscribe and ring the bell uh, to be notified about all future live streams, including my main live show, Miles Dyer Live, every Wednesday. It's the 100th episode of Wednesday, so it should be good. And uh, yeah, hit the like button. And if you are watching on replay, comment with your thoughts. I always like to read them. And without further ado, as they say on YouTube, let's jump straight into it. So here we are. And already, like, moments like this with incredible tracking I'm just like I love PSVR 2 so much it's so smooth and awesome and look at this environment hopefully um, the visuals uh, in terms of how dark it is um, looks fine and uh, the sound levels are good um, but yeah the visuals are amazing and the music as well so I think we should probably start off with the tutorial I was wondering if I was even shooting it at that point Press fire to start tutorial. Okay. Ooh, okay. Use R2 or the L2 button and aim and fire at the ball. Okay, use R2. Okay, so you can switch. It is very warm here in the UK at the moment, um, and I was just wafting down some dinner before coming on. Um, Unfortunately, this isn't going to be taking with too much motion, so I don't have to worry about moving around a lot after a, a big meal. Um, right. I guess I'll just shoot that. Or does it just keep going in cycles? Is that what you do? Okay, interesting. Fire and quickly direct the ball. Flick your wrist during rebounds to aim. See, it'd be nice if during this tutorial you actually got to try it out, because at the moment it's telling me this stuff, and I'm like, okay, I think I'll remember to do this. Aiming is the most vital skill, okay. Oh wait, was that not it? Okay. It's not letting me... I mean, okay, we've got practice here. There we go, this is what I was after. Okay, that feels awesome. Okay, this is cool. This is what I wanted. I have to say... Hmm. Okay, so yeah, I get the flick. Understood. I'm trying to flick it. So what you do is you kind of shoot. Maybe you flick as you... No, you... definitely a game that's going to take some getting used to. Can I just hit that one target? Yeah! I mean, the music and everything is awesome in this. The haptics feel great. So I thought it could go behind you and you could, like, miss. But it seems like that can't happen, so the ball is always safe. But getting it, it is just going to be something that comes with practice. I guess you could do that. Okay, that's... Okay, there we go. Get in there. I'll just practice a couple more times. So, the other things haven't unlocked yet, so I assume that will be once we do it. 
select difficulty. It, okay, this is one thing I'm noticing straight away is when you select stuff, you, it does. You do get the haptics, but all targets of aiming vibration, threshold effect on hook ray. Is that telling me what it is? Challenging, fast pulls more. Okay, we'll do. Oh, okay, these are presets. Gotcha. Okay. All right. Go with this. Well, that's kind of cool. That's changed now. But that's in this one. Mighty cubes. Got, no, not ranked yet. Huh? Surely someone's played this already. Off the shoulders of Orion. Okay, so I'm going to click that. And here we are. So I'm going to shoot. Ah, oh, so it can hit you. <laughs> okay. There we go. That's what I was wondering. I was like, surely there has to be a challenge of it hitting you. So I lost a life already. Ooh. I tell you what, when it starts coming towards you, you definitely see it. I did want to jump in blind, that is correct. This is awesome. Oh, it's rotating. That's super cool. So although you're like hitting individual pieces, it is like functioning as a... Final shot. Oh, final shot. That was pretty sinister. I'm not expecting to complete this now, but... I'll give it my best. This is something I love about VR, is it allows you to like revitalize arcade classics or reimagine them. Extra cool. Oh, that music is epic. I've got double the fun trophy there. Oh, I see. Okay, this is cool. This is the sort of stuff I was hoping to see. Multi ball. Woo! And now I'm coming forward again. That was interesting. This is awesome. Is Brian still in the chat or anyone else? How much? How much is this on the PlayStation Store? I've actually got the uh, description in the. Uh, what? I've got it in the description in the uh, PlayStation Store. But this is. This feels awesome. Okay, I've learned now. Flicking down like this is probably my go-to technique. Do it that way as well. Oh Game shit! <laughs> no, you can't do it that way. Game over. Okay, we'll go again. And if you can hit it, you can't get it into the gaps, but let's go from the side. No, nope. that didn't work. Oh. I see some. 14.99. That's a good price for something like this. Final shot. So you can see some of the blocks lighting up. Which I assume are points. Oh, it's giving you a multiplier maybe. This music is epic. Don't. Combo master. Get out of the way, trophy. I'm trying to look. And I got first of many. Oh my god, when's it going to come at me? Okay, I don't like that, because it sort of goes side to side and then it suddenly comes towards you. But that's something I'm just going to have to get used to. I also got brick by brick. Wow, well, I'm getting all the trophies. I guess that's us. Oh, an end to the brick. All right, trophies. Get out of the way now. I bet the picture quality is really crisp on the side of the screen, because it's really crisp in the headset. Oh, now we've got multiple. There we go. Keep them alternating. Let one do the work while the other heads on over. Back to me. Here we go. Look at them doing a dance. Woo. Extra ball. An extra ball. Well, I'm going 
freezer company, it says. Okay. This is awesome. And I love the way the music builds up. Oh no! No, I missed it! So you don't use a light, it's only when the last one. Yeah, the aiming. So I assume in the settings there's something that means you know when you're locking onto it, or is it this? You just gotta hope. Power up. Dome. What's dome? Does it just keep it in there? I guess so. But once the dome's gone, it's gonna come right back at me. Here we go. I love that. When you do the multi ball, it um, zooms you out. That's super cool. I wanna look behind me, but. Right, can I just shoot at him? Oh. Moment of truth. Can I do this? Go on! No. Yeah, the music's great, isn't it? It does look good. Look at all these shapes. I like this. Oh, I did it. I got two stars. That's not bad. That's not bad. Yeah, this is... I love this. I love this a lot. Uh, so I can replay it or go to the next. Right, oh, this is nice. Now I assume I've only got one life still. Oh wow, look! It's like chipping away the big blocks. I like any games where there's like damage that can be done. Who remembers Red Faction? I think Red Faction was one of the first games to, you know, that was the selling point of that game where they just said everything is indestructible. And I used to love playing multiplayer on Red Faction 2. Where you would see... Extra ball. Yeah, the music's amazing. Um, but yeah, Red Faction, Extra there was a multiplayer mode where it was whoever could destroy the most of the area. So you just like keep placing bombs and seeing buildings get destroyed and that. I wonder how many multiples you can get. Three is what I've done so far. Oh no! Magna? Extra ball. Oh, got an extra ball there. So I could have found out if it was going to be four. Nice! So I could do more subtle movements. Look at that! Whoa! New best. New best. This music. This music. Music is the ultimate thing in games, isn't it? Wow. And this is a game that as you like become more with it... Well, it puts a big smile on my face, but... That's it. A lot of you in the chat telling me about uh, Red Faction. Um, yeah. So, like, stuff like this. And what I like is... The shapes are interesting. The colours are so vibrant. And I'm someone who actually, since launch, I've actually turned down the uh, headset brightness by like 50%. And it still looks fantastic. Um. Welcome, welcome, welcome. On today's Let's Plays, we've got three new games. Today, we're going to be playing... Masternoid, which we're doing now. Then we're going to play C Smash VRS, and then we'll end the evening with Hubris. So if you're watching, oh, laser, that's cool. Oh wow! See already, it's like there's loads of power-ups and that that are really interesting. Look at this. I know Brian asked when he came in. I heard there's going to be pizza. I think this could be it. This is a pile of. Uh, is it called Voxel? Isn't that what this is called? Voxel Pizza? <laughs> this is super cool. Power up. So I assume that just means it's going to do more destruction when it hits stuff. Wow. Come back. Thunder? Whoa, 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 whoa. That, that threw me off. 
Now, it would be nice if there was a way of seeing how many lives you've got. Now, I don't know if there is, and I'm just missing it. But I'm looking to see if there's like a HUD. I mean, I like that the HUD is minimal. Complete. I'm Near trying best. to have a look. Yeah, I didn't do very well that time. Wow, this is colourful. Here we go. But yeah, I don't think you can see how, how many lives you've got anywhere. And you can't switch gun in-game. Gotcha. Okay. So no juggling. Oh, how thin is it? I'm trying to get it underneath. Interesting. Just keep getting it round the back. <laughs> Let's just keep doing that then. And then, yeah, Hubris will be at the evening with, so... Look forward to it. But do subscribe if you haven't already, or if you know anyone else that's into Let's Plays and VR, pass it on. Because I'm on that battle for 50,000 subscribers, and... I cleared 48,000 many times this year already, and uh, I think I'm at 48,001 subscriber, because I'm still losing a lot of old subscriber accounts. In August, it will be 17 years since I've been on YouTube, a long time. But I tell you what, I think I found my home with uh, the Wednesday talk show, and then these Let's Plays. Really good one. This is... I can't explain how good this feels. Is there anyone that's looking at this and thinking, this looks like my kind of game? This is a great game to show people that have not played VR much, although, you know, it's a bit tricky to get used to. As you can see in the tutorial, I wasn't exactly sure, but Trouble. It might be a bit boring that I keep throwing it the same way, but Ooh. thank you very much. That's such a great thing to say. Yeah, swapping hands mid-match would be uh, interesting. But yeah, Silver Nexus was just saying, brighter than where I was last year at this time, which is absolutely true. I think it's going to be a very exciting year for this channel, and uh, I can't thank you all enough for uh, joining me again, whether live or on replay. It all helps. And... Uh, yeah, this is going to be a fun weekend. Woo! Go on. Now, do you know what would make this game the best? And I don't, I don't know if it's a feature. Do you know what I'm going to say? If you could create your own maps. If they did like a community thing where you could create maps and challenge your friends this game oh my god how good would that be Level complete new best Woo. I kind of want to exit and have a look but let's just keep oh wow that is cool I guess I'm gonna go right in the middle you ready or should I get on the inside like there here we go Ooh. Too good to be true, having a map creator. I mean, it would be quite an ambitious thing, but... Can you imagine, like, creating a PSVR without parole logo? You know? That's the sort of stuff people would share online and go, like... You know? Oh, that would be... I, I reckon that would be great for the game. But extra ball. Ooh, extra ball, there we go. Now I wonder. Whoa. 
I wonder what makes them... <clears throat> oh. I wonder what makes the actual big object rotate. You know, the overall object. This music, I can't get over how good it is. Not repetitive. It kind of, it feels froggy. Yeah, this the idea that you're whipping it as you're shooting felt a bit odd. But I totally get it now. The way I can describe it is it feels like, um, you know, like with a fishing rod that you're kind of flicking it out. There's that HUD in the background, like the uh, like a little solar system. Does that to do with combos or? Yeah. Complete. New best. Okay. Okay. At least there's replay now, so that looks like. Oh, here we go. Around me, top ten high schools, and then friends. Look, look at this. Look at Brian. Brian is 83rd in the world. Amazing. Although, if I do go back... Oh, is that changing the music? Okay. So if I click that, yeah, I can just see the high schools. Oh! Did I beat Brian on this one? Yeah. But I did get very lucky with this one. 31 in the world. Wow, look at those schools. Be interesting to like learn what it what it requires. So you get one star for completing the level, and then a star for each of the target amounts. That's kind of cool. Ah, uh, a master noid is the level framework. Wait, right, what's here? New tutorial. Oh, here we go. Multiple. Here we go. This is good. Every brick hides multipliers, which are those little dots that we saw. Collect them with the ball. Try to get them before they expire. Collect many for a higher score. Okay. Your multiplier tank is at the top, which is what we were talking about. Every ring you fill is an extra ball. Extra balls greatly increase. What's that? Feel? Every ring you fill is an extra ball. I see now. Gotcha. That's what it was. That's cool. That's really cool. And then power-ups. Every block might spawn a power-up. So the multi-ball wasn't actually a power-up. The longer you keep a ball, oh, rebounds the ball carrying the power-up to activate. What's the second thing? The longer you keep a ball in play, the bigger the chance. Okay. That's cool. Someone was asking, is this on PSVR 2? Uh, it is indeed. Watch all the tutorial videos. Is this hard? Um, I'll let the chat decide. I mean, it was tricky, but I'm sort of getting the hang of it. Okay, what's this? Sphere core. I feel like this is like a boss. Here we go. Took a little bit to get used to, but it's just like it's an arcadey challenge, you know? I feel like. The shapes aren't, and look, I've only just played the first one, so I could be wrong. The shapes, I don't feel like... Laser. 
doesn't feel like there's anything that's going to increase the difficulty. Well, there's an easier setting on this. But yeah, like, unless you start playing in maps where stuff is really close to you, I can't see this game getting harder. Because it's you're just doing the same thing, aren't you? Extra ball. Extra ball. Look at those orbits. Okay, that's good to know that when they're coming at you quick, you can just shoot them instead of flicking them. You can shoot at them away, like that. Look at that red that red orbit. Maybe that's the final one. Come on. Someone in the chat is saying about games being too difficult and that uh, developers should know people don't want difficult games. I mean, for me, it's like developers should make the game they want. You should have some difficult games, have some that aren't. Um, I mean, you could always do a story mode in that, but I think in VR it's probably a bit harder to do. Because a lot of it requires physicality. In that. No, I didn't get to fall that time. Oh no! How is that? Is that better? I've turned the music down as opposed to me up. Um, although, it's not going red actually. How is that? Is that better? Better. That's good. You are my producers. Here we go. Also, the music's gone quiet now. It was just when it was really building up. But who agrees with me? A map creator. That would be amazing for this game. And I always hate to be that person like when playing these games that, you know, I've barely played it and I'm already saying, oh, why doesn't it have this feature? Like, it's more of a compliment. I just love the, um, the level designs. And I'm just like, oh, I'd love to create my own. Because it's also a game where creating your own it's not it wouldn't be a, a massive task because you know you have a sort of a framework it could be really simple shapes extra ball here we go extra let's see how many extra balls i can get Oh, I hit two at the same time then. Here we go. Yeah, flicking it to the walls definitely feels... Oh, no! Flicking it sideways is not good. Up and down, because then you keep it in, in, in the middle. Like, that sort of line of sight is good. Across, that's where it can kind of throw you off. At least for me, anyway. Actually, I'll probably mess up now. I've said that. Again, music is just incredible. Go and pick up all that stuff that's spilled out. Thunder. 
I don't actually know what Thunder does. I haven't worked that one out yet. Oh no, that was it. That was it. Extra ball. Kind of made a um, like a chain reaction. Just whenever I see Thunder, I see it going around the outskirts of like, uh, what's that doing? Oh no! That was close. I just noticed when you shoot, you see little sparks. Like that. Now, can I just hold it down? Nope, you can't. That'd be cheating. Let's get to test. Oh, I did better than I thought I did. Wow, this is nice. This was from the sphere as well, wasn't it? I thought this was um, like just from the boss one. But it keeps going. That's it, get it behind. Get it behind there. Here we go. Oh, shouldn't do that. Don't do it across, Miles. You've already explained that's bad. Woo. Do you hit that like button if you haven't already? Let's see if we can get it up to. Let me take a guess. Let's see if we can get it up to 50 likes by the end of the stream. And then you tell me we're already there, which I, I doubt, but. Stranger things have happened. <laughs> So fire means it just goes, whoa, it goes through it. Go on. Oh, come on. There we go. How long does the fire last for? I guess it. Oh, well, they're both on fire now. Or not, no. It's the down technique. Oh! <laughs> Every I know I keep saying this, but like the music is so good. Dome. In the dome, go on. Do some serious damage in the dome. You can hit it when it's really far away, look. Like that. So you don't actually have to wait for it to come near. Whoa, that was too close. Oh no! I lost my first life in a very long time. points for not losing lives. I know it says like for to keep going you get you build up a um, more of a multiplier. So come on, almost there. Oh final shot. So I think I only game over twice at the start, didn't I?
Come on! That last bit of green. Level complete. New best. Right, here we go. Oh, this looks like uh, an alien eye. So you want to get it in there. In that bit. Go on. Yeah! Oh no, I didn't pick up all those bonus points. This music sounds like it could be a Lindsay Sterling track. Get it in the eye. Go on. There's all those bonus points I'm not getting. It's so sad. Oh, there we go. Go on. What about all those points down there? Go on, burn. Let's go. Burn, burn, burn. Burn, burn, burn. It's like it gives up after a while. It keeps bouncing and goes, no, nah, I'm coming back to you. I have to say, like at the moment, my only critiques of this game have been the menu. The menu doesn't feel very intuitive, but the game itself, this is awesome. this game managed to do <laughs> brand deals for IP, you could do like, bra like DLC around certain game properties, that'd be epic. Hello, I'm the EZP. Yeah, so um, I do Let's Plays every weekend. Um, I normally do them... I normally do them once a weekend, but now... I'm doing several each weekend because my mission is to play every PSVR 2 game as a let's play, as its own let's play, which means all the VR games that I did at the start. Looks like I'm going to get an extra ball when I hit this last thing. No ball wasted. Finish a level without losing a life. Yeah, all the games that I did at launch, like Call of the Mountain, GT7. All of them, Kayak VR, they'll all be getting their own individual Let's Play at some point. But today, it's all about new games. And we've got some new games to play next weekend as well. So, uh, that's going to be kind of cool. Every weekend it'll be like, new games, and then also looking back at some classics. If we can even call them that on PSVR 2. Oh, there's some classic PSVR 2 games. You know, 100 days on. Extra ball. Extra ball. Yeah, it's gets to be hard to rest for Oh no, I missed that. I wanted to go for four balls. Woo! Stop paying attention. Pick up that point dust, I'm going to call it. Point dust. Oh. That's cool. But look at all those points. No! Get them all. There we go. Got some of them. There we go. Got some more. Yeah, I think sometimes in those moments you want to stop flicking and more just shooting it.
sorry, I'm really concentrating now. Especially while the music's so epic. Oh! That was probably one star. Wow, that was right. Woo. Right. Woo. There we go, let's have a look here. Okay, so oh, okay, I thought that was like the boss for the first one, it wasn't. Now, is there a trophy for getting three stars on everything? Look at that one. What a small team. Alright, let's have a look here. I guess we carry on. We carry on, everyone. So it doesn't tell you, this is why there was no score, so it doesn't tell you until you've completed it. Which I think is kind of cool, because it means that you're just going to enjoy the game. And then at the end you're like, oh, okay, based on that, that's what you scored, do you want to have another go? Oh, that's cracking. Interesting, okay, I like this. So I'm trying to work out what, what mechanic each level has brought in. I feel like the first two levels were the same. Or did someone else notice anything different? Because this third level... Is, is bringing in blocks that take damage. So this will be curious to see how the game gets more challenging. Thunder, thunder. Thunder blocks. Du, 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 du. Extra ball. Oh. This is like proper dark punk. Oh. I've just noticed. They go through each other. Oh! That totally took me by surprise! moments like this I think in the future you'll be playing games like this and like you know when I look in the sky you can see that sort of like wormhole yeah what they'll do is you'll play a game like this and you'll look around you and you'll see like other players doing their single player like you'll see them in their own boxes in the distance that'd be amazing Yeah, but that was good. Let's get rid of those purple ones. See, already now I'm like, okay, so with the laser, before it was like, oh, you just shoot anything. Now it's like, oh, no, you want to take away those tougher blocks. I just love these things flying around the sky. Oh. Extra, 
Oh. Further back. Oh! <laughs> Okay, I'm just gonna go dead straight. That was not dead straight. That was terrible. Let's just keep going there. Oh. Probably should stop declaring where I'm aiming for, because then it shows you that my intention is not very closely aligned with my action in this game. Power ups, you just want to get as much many collisions because I think they're all time based. Three stars for the platinum. Possibly. Part of me feels for three stars, it's like just about not losing lives. Or losing balls. Extra ball. Here we go. Wow, that one in the back stayed there for a while. Here it comes. Yeah, I'm learning to like flick less when it comes to um Oh Whoa This is awesome. This is all yeah, this okay, I'm getting the hang of this now. Having to sort of do more shooting. Thunder, thunder, thunder. Thunder ran out, didn't get to use it. Probably. Just get it in that bit there. There we go. Magnet. Awesome. So the magnet obviously attracts all the point dust. It says I'm there. Oh no, I just lost one. And I just got the extra ball. I was just about to get the ball quad. Let's see if I can get four balls before the end of the stream. It's very, very warm, and I definitely will be taking more regular flight breaks uh, this this week. A um, egg. Uh, what's it called? I would call it an egg timer. But it's not an egg timer. It's the um, what's the timer called with sand? It is. A, it's just called a sand timer. Yeah. I thought it had another name.
come on. Hourglass, thank you, Aceville. Extra good to see you here, dude. I say see, see you. I mean, good to hear you. Well, it's not even you, it's some robot. It's good. It's good to hear a robotic representation of your text on screen, Aceville. That's what I meant to say. Doesn't sound quite poetic. This is cool. Oh! I'm oh. <laughs> I thought I was going to enjoy this game, but I have to say I'm very impressed with this. This is a really well made game. Can we get that red ring complete? Come on. Come on. Oh yay, great point. There is a demo of this game. So if you have PSVR 2, try out the demo. That's gonna be the best way. Totally forgot about that. There is a demo indeed. Come on. Maximum. Maximum. There we go. Maximum. Quadruple trouble, it says. That's the trophy. I just... The thing is, when the trophies pop up, they block your view. And now I lost one. New milestone reach, it said. You have to look at the trophy list. There we go. Last one. Last two bits. Come on. Go on. Level complete. Woo. New best. New best. Wow. Hello, mushroom. We're going down here. No, that was poor. We'll do that again. terrible in this one. Alright, let's do some sideways stuff. Whoa! That was not good. Didn't know you could fling it that steep. Oh, see, look, if you do that, that is dodgy. You've got to do it like that. But then even then, you have to have forward momentum or it just goes, nope, you're coming back to you. Yeah, I find that going like that is always going to be better. That's it, I wanted some combos. There we go, that's a bit better. Thunder. Go on. Oh, I've run out. That's it, pick up all that point dust. Almost got enough for a multi ball. Oh, don't. 
That's it. Keep going, keep going. Extra ball. There we go, me extra ball. So for those that are just joining, you see that, like, you've got the score at the top with your multiplier. The, the times two is how many balls you've got. And then the rings are every time one of them fills up, you unlock another ball. Up to four. And what you're doing is you're shooting Extra and flicking. But you can also just shoot them like that. But yeah, I want them to allow you to create your own levels. That'd be amazing. Oh, shit. Look at the dust when I'm missing stuff. Come back. Lost. No, it's over there. The fact I'm hitting those small last bits Extra ball. shows I'm getting better. Was that the last one of it? Complete. No, we've got one more, I think. Here we go. No, 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 don't let all those points go. Ah. Point dust disappears so quick. So who's getting the who's getting the demo? I think if you have a PSVR 2, this is a no-brainer. Get the demo and then get a real sense of it because it's awesome. And I think this is the perfect game to do a demo of. You'll quickly learn the mechanics. Extra ball. That's cool. Definitely, yeah, definitely try it. We have uh, I'm having a good time. We've got one of the devs in the chat right now. He's just joined. Yeah, I think this game, no, you won't. Like, if you if you enjoy this kind of game, you'll be like, okay, I want to explore the other maps. But yeah, the thing I'm trying to work out with this game is this is the, thir the third set of levels. I'm curious to know what difficulties are added to make this game more difficult as you go throughout. Because on the third level, which I'm on now, um, they added like blocks that don't break straight away. They fracture. I don't know if there were increments in the first two levels. But um, yeah, I'm glad I managed to get the four ball combo. 
on this last level. That I'd be doing. But I was also saying you have to you should you should create a map a map creator so we can create our own maps. That would be amazing for the community. There we go. And I love it that you can just have a look here. This is super cool. Right. Where are we now? Noi champion I got. Complete all levels in three different worlds. So yeah, this one here. There are... Oh, no, I'm sure. And that's the thing. Whenever recommending features, I do it with complete compassion and empathy. Like, it's just enthusiastic suggestions. I'm not one of those people like, oh, yeah, why don't you just put in a map creator? Like, I can imagine it'd be very difficult. But especially if you did it like it was something you unlocked once you got to the end or something. Uh, um, but, yeah. Right, let's have a look how we did for time. Oh. Um, yeah, we'll do one more. We'll do one more set of levels. And then um, I need to get ready for the next one. Uh, here we go. Do you know what, actually? Before I start... I just think creating levels would be so shareable online. Like, we could literally create the logo for our show <laughs> or like destroying a PS5 or you know <laughs> or an Xbox or okay I've oh, okay so one thing I've noticed is you can't switch I've accidentally switched my hands on the gun so I can't will it let me switch now no it won't so I have to come out and then switch and then go back in okay let's do this But yeah, I've noticed in terms of the strategy, going sideways like that is dangerous. Going up and down, I can deal with. But it just might it might be to do with the angle that I do it. It makes sense why you can't switch it when the match starts because um, especially on like something like C Smash you um, you don't want to get out of reach of your opponent and like make them switch hands with the racket last minute Love, I just love the music in this so much where did you get the music from? because it's so good Thunder! Come on, don't waste it. Go on, Thunder. So the Thunder, I think, it even affects it when it's near it. It doesn't actually just have to hit it to create a chain reaction. Schools is nothing to do with how quick you do it, right? Maximum energy. Finish a level with four balls in play. It's all about maintaining that high combo. That's 
that's awesome. Oh, I love that. These designs are just so cool. Super awesome. Right. Yeah. Or as I call them, pixel dust. <laughs> or uh, point dust. I was calling them. Ah, oh, this is cool. Also, what is it that causes the full shape to rotate? Is there... Because... I love that. It's such a cool thing in the game. The fact that this isn't static. Oops. Lost concentration there. I love, I love that it certain hits cause it to rotate. But I assume it will never rotate fully around, right? If I keep hitting one side. Rotating. That's awesome. I guess that naturally you're going to hit different points of it anyway, so. Yeah. I mean, I'd love to see if I could rotate it all the way around, but I don't think it's going to happen. And these power-ups, like Fire and Thunder, they're, they're, they're time... Uh, they're, they're, they last for a certain time, not number of hits, right? Okay, so different power-ups have different bounces, gotcha. And when you say bounces, you mean in terms of off the player, like throwing them back in. The dome is a lovely one. And also, I love that as you get a multi-ball, you go further out. That's a really nice touch. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's amazing, the slightest loss of concentration. This is, um... Extra ball. Get that point dust. Yeah, and as the dev, if you have any questions for me, feel free to ask away. Um, I've definitely been asking you loads. Oh, look at that, all that power up stuff. Magnet, love it. Magnet picks everything up. That sort of heartbeat sound is like when it's about to give you another multi ball. It's like almost filled up. There we go. Oh. Ah, oh, heartbeat is through a magnet, okay. Gotcha. So magnet lasts quite a bit actually. I thought magnet was like a singular use, if that makes sense. Ah oh. Yeah, the music is so great and dynamic. The magnet's time base, that's cool. Best. I like that new best. But it's my first time doing it. A strawberry! 
are, please tell me there's a level in it which is a giant pizza. If not, you need to add it, please. Big, big, big giant pizza. Right. Oh, it looks hollow. Pineapple in it, yeah. That's the bit that some people will hit off first. They're like, oh, I don't like pineapple on my pizza. I'll knock those bits off. Look at that. That strawberry is rotating loads. Uh, let's get all that dust. Look at all that dust. Get it. No. Yes. Whoa. That was a combo. Extra ball. Yes. Dome, all of you. I don't want to jinx it, but I'm on track to get a good score here, I think. Yeah, it's the soundtrack on Spotify. That's awesome. The music video should just be a level, right? Being played, although I know it's about being dynamic, seeing what it's kind of match what's going on, but... <laughs> it is so warm in this studio. I totally respect that. I, I was looking at the credits and seeing how small the team is. You've done a, you've all done a brilliant job with this. So huge congrats to you all. And I hope. Yeah, this is a trading mo montage. I hope the whole team is celebrating and having a, going to be having a relaxing week after this. Wow. Just keep looking at the time. We're good. I think there might be one more level after this for the for the world. So I'll see how. I think this might take a while to do. But um, this might be my last one then, because I just want to take the headset off for a bit and chill for half an hour before the next Let's Play, which will be Sea Smash, which has some similarities to this. Um, this is so good. Oh, and thunder. Wow. Get all that. Get all the points. Get all the points. The magnet. Oh, and I messed up. The magnet was exactly what I needed. Keep going. Oh, I can't believe I wasted that ball. Right, 
look at this. It's like a... Extra ball. Yeah, it's going to be very toasty by the time I'm playing Hoobris tonight. No! no! Very good fun. Do hit the like button if you haven't already, people, and subscribe uh, for all future Let's Plays. Um, there are so many other great games planned for this weekend and for the weeks ahead. Um, some awesome games coming out. And also, I need your help because I want to get to 50,000 subscribers by the end of the year. And at the moment, I keep hitting 48,000 and then going below it again just because... I've got an old YouTube channel, so I need your help to let me turn it around. Oh, that's one I need, Magnet. Look at that, all those... Fire. Magnet, that's it. There we go. I just, I think the way that the maps, uh, the, the the levels that you're trying to de-block, as I call it, the fact they rotate is such an awesome touch. Because static would have been the expected thing, which would have been fine, but like it just makes it so much more interesting, especially when you're in VR. And because you're static, it just means you get a good view of what you're attacking. And it also means if you're struggling to get certain bits, there's a chance that rotating it will help you out. Or hinder you. <laughs> Extra ball. Almost there. I'm surprised how quickly I did that. Right, we'll do the last one. Here we go. Oh, wow. Okay, these are all solid, so they've got to be cracked open. Right, here we go. Let's, let's start smashing it around like this. I like that you can shoot it when it's still like, over there. Go, that's it. Go, 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 go. Thunder. Come on. This is a cracking level. My overall feelings of this game is, this is brilliant. Um, it's simple, but it's well executed. And um, even though it, it sort of rhymes with a lot of arcade games, in terms of its style, it does feel Extra. like it has its own original touch. Now, that might be because I haven't played a specific arcade like, game like this. 
but the idea that you're sort of flicking it, the fact that this rotates, takes advantage of the VR space, um, yeah, I'm definitely going to be playing more of this. But I do think um, map customization would be an incredible addition, and um, I do feel that the main menu could be more intuitive, but like the main core gameplay is excellent. And I also want to see there be more power-ups, but I appreciate that might become a game-breaking thing. Awesome. Extra ball. I like how things slow down when you need an extra ball. The fact I'm able to hit things so accurately now is ridiculous. There we go. Do these all have names? They do. Wow. I tell you what, if the if the dev's still there, um, I would love to ask for the list of level names just so I can timestamp them uh, properly. But Nikos, um, who's been in the chat, huge thank you. Much love to the entire team and uh, Petros, uh, excellent work with, with the music, so um, yeah, yeah, because I'm, like, yeah, I'm just going to do timestamps for each of these names, Equilibrium, just for the first four, but yeah, no worries, um, thank you for the key, um, yeah, Pixel Magnet is a great name uh, for, a, for a dev team. Um, I need to go cool off now, so uh, I want to say a huge thank you to everyone for tuning in to this Let's Play. Once more, I would wish uh, that you would hit the like button on your way out. Do subscribe uh, and ring the bell to be notified about all future Let's Plays, because I am going to be playing every PSVR 2 title there is, or at least try to. Um, all are available on my channel. Uh, I do Miles Dyer Live, my talk show, every Wednesday and every Friday. I co-host with Brian Paul on PSVR Without Parole Gamescast Live. If you want to go a little bit further in supporting the channel, um, because I don't do paid sponsorships, um, please do uh, think about becoming a member by clicking the join button for as little as a price of a cup of coffee uh, at your local cafe um, a month. Um, and then you unlock all the features like emojis and things like that and badges. Uh, or feel free to do a super chat like some of you have done today. And for that, I'm incredibly grateful. So on that note, have a wonderful rest of your day. And I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye. Thank you.